Hello and welcome to another update video about Matic. The Matic chart is um, breaking, or it did break yesterday overnight below micro support, which means that either wave B already topped. So this B wave that we've been talking about, it was previously the orange scenario, but honestly, orange is so difficult to, to see on the chart. I, I changed it to white. Um, so in, in this scenario, uh, one second. Let me just change that as well, because I don't want to create confusion. So, yeah, okay. So it's all about this structure here now. So we could still be in a B wave, um, but obviously probability is that the C wave to the downside has started to unfold. They have increased. Yeah, and this is precisely the pattern we've been watching for. I mean, this B wave, right? The thing is, the B wave looks a bit unfinished. I, I can say the same that I said about Bitcoin, basically, that, yeah, this last spike that we've seen yesterday, which touched the 50% retracement level at $1.09, I mean, that could have completed, that could have completed the B wave, okay? We were waiting for one more high, okay, what one more high happened, but, yeah, it, it, I don't know, it doesn't have the right look. So, I'm exploring still the potential, because I don't want to, I don't want that anybody is surprised by this, if it happens. I'm still exploring the idea, and it's interesting, by the way, that Bitcoin is fairly strong, actually, at the moment, um, nearly at 71k again, and the altcoins here are just bleeding again, okay? But I, therefore, I explore the idea that this structure, which was a simple ABC structure, has morphed and transformed into a WXY pattern in wave B. That's just simply, it's not a reliable structure, it's not anything to, really to rely on, you know? WXY, but it's a possibility and I just want to entertain the idea until we break below 97.6 cents. That's still a somewhat reliable scenario. Um, okay, not reliable, but a somewhat at least reasonable scenario to watch for at least. We need to see, however, how the market is reacting to this pivot here between 97.6 cents and $1.01. ,01. A break below 97.6 cents would suggest that the C wave to the downside is unfolding okay and that the b wave topped so that's sort of what i'm tracking right now um either way this is still a bullish structure but obviously i would prefer a little bit more of a healthy b wave because that gives the c wave to the downside more space if the b wave or had if the b wave has topped then the downside target for wave c is pretty much the 70 yeah 77 cent level so it's just below the 78.6 retracement. Now, below because that level is not an invalidation point, um, it, it is possible that we get a wick below maybe. Okay, so that's the 100% extension. Let's see. But I would prefer, obviously, if the 100% extension level, which is a common target for such a C wave, if that was a little higher. So, But yeah, that's what I'm watching for, an A, B, C structure. And the B wave could have transformed into a WXY pattern and it's just not a reliable structure and the break below 97.6 cents would confirm further that we see to the downside has started and then next structural support will be around 95 cents and you know the best confirmation we can get is a break below 91.2 cents and if we turn around here and if if it gives us one more high in wave c of y one more high in wave y then it's probably going to take us to round about $1.12, $1.13. That's 61.8 retracement. That's just a quick update about Matic. Hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Also, make sure that you follow us on Instagram and Twitter for additional content. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.